Good morning, people! I am a little bit later today because yesterday I spent all day getting my new studio space ready for when I take pictures, which is exciting. Same building, just somewhere else, where there is tall ceilings and light and everything. I will show you guys the space, but I did get some things ready because I do have a customer today. So that's why I'm a little bit later, but let's jump into it. Wisdom of the Oracle. We have spoken about this energy for the past long while. That there is such a big shift happening. It's, it's crazy. We all feel it. <laughs> Radiator gave a confirmation. And... I also feel something that's really active right now is that we see the truth when it comes to other people. Like people's true face, true intentions, which means that um, we read people in an easier way. So it's also easy for you to tap into people's energy and realize what's actually going on but there is just a lot of things happening when it comes to other people so pay attention to that nothing is wrong with you but you know the gift is here for a reason yeah okay i have a hair that's annoying me let's see universe to be fair, often it, often, often, that's two conflicting entities, isn't it? Very interesting combination, to be fair. Realizing something and taking a step. Hmm. To be fair is like the justice card, so it's the Libra card. So I feel that, again, there is something you're realizing. I actually do want to take the book so that we can get the messages in full action. Oh, it's here. Balance, justice, and need to consider options. Mutable benefits, the law of cause and effect. So let's keep that in mind, shall we? Then I will take the other one. Oh, like there was something. So the orphan, a sense of loss, an identity crisis, recognizing that you don't fit in, the need to belong, uncertainty about your plan, your place. Well, maybe there's something about a plan. What are you separating your, yourself from? To be fair, why is this feeling coming up? Um. I feel like a spirit guide does, like, ask you that question a lot today. Like, to be fair, you know why you feel this way. You know that your feelings are right about a person. You know that you have made the right decision. decision. And, like I said, we do see the truth in well, situations, but also when it comes to other people. So it's actually very easy to weigh options. You can also see this like owl balancing on her head. So you do know. You do know. To be fair, you do know. Yeah, Queen of Wands. Be optimistic. Be optimistic. Nine of Cups. You will succeed, but I feel in some case, Seven of Cups, you have other options when it comes to something. Doesn't want to focus on it. Anyway, shop. Hmm. There might be something with a business or something. I do want to have a little bit more information about the orphan. Wow. Stand up for yourself. That is strong. Yeah. No matter what's happening, stand up for yourself. Keep fighting. Pr protect the people you love. Protect your own energy. And just keep going. It's very simple today. 
there might have been well there is i feel for a lot of us there is a lot of things coming up where we are like why is this person acting like that like what's going on and sometimes we do take it too hard but i feel it's very important for us to distance ourselves from other people's drama or other people's opinions because then we do end up feeling orphaned a loss or, or we wobble we have an identity crisis because we compare ourselves with someone who might act in a strange way in a stupid way in an unfair way so to be honest you need to just keep track on your own plans and do what's best for you because with the nine of cups you are manifesting very fast what it is that you want look closer there might be something with the way that you can make money there might be something you have to leave that's draining you it could be an old work situation it could be connected with people that you work with that someone is draining or someone is just nagging you someone is like straight up nasty and i do pay attention to this he's actually sitting with a book writing the best way for you to actually steer away from this energy is to seven of wands stand up for yourself stand strong keep going move forward but also manifest the outcome that you want it's not about putting your focus on the bad things the negative things but just focus on what it is that you truly believe in now and then your circumstances will, ch will change the people that are nasty will just suddenly move away or being fired or <laughs> whatever they will not be in your life because you don't have space for that anymore i think that is the very quick message today you are standing up for yourself you're writing down <laughs> things that you want to focus on you're listening to your intuition looking closer at your options because again there is like a poison bottle here right so be careful be careful be mindful not everything that shines is gold it's <laughs> not something like that and like i also have said we are actually learning to not go after the gold but to go after the good feeling because that is what brings gold and abundance the gold doesn't bring gold the good feelings and happiness brings gold <laughs> yes all right that is it people hope you will have a magical day and i will see you guys tomorrow it's the weekend reading tomorrow right yes adieu